An Everett family is seeking $20 million from the Everett School District, saying their son was relentlessly bullied and ruthlessly beaten, all because he's gay. The family alleges the school allowed an environment where hate crimes could flourish and even be put on the Internet. We do want to warn you, this video can be hard to watch. Here's King 5's Eric Wilkinson. <laughs> Nicole and Doug Stanford watch in disgust as their 13-year-old son is attacked at his own school. It's going to take a while to bounce back from this. In this video, the student is jumped by a group of girls who throw him to the ground where he is brutally beaten. It's one of three such attacks caught on video this year, and each of them, the attackers, all believed to be students at Everett's Evergreen Middle School, scream anti-gay slurs at the defenseless boy. It's terrible. It's our one job to keep him safe. And the only place we can't keep him safe is in the school. The teen's parents say it started on the very first day of school when their son was pushed off his school bus and told not to return because he's gay. It does something to you as a parent in your heart that you just can't. I mean, there's just no way. The parents say the harassment was constant and even pre-planned. They believe the attackers told other students about upcoming beatings so they could have their cell phones rolling and post the videos to social media. The couple took their child out of school in May but say those perpetrating the violence were allowed to stay. Those weren't fights, those were beatings. The couple has now filed an administrative claim against the Everett School District saying it allowed hate crimes to be committed and failed to provide a safe learning environment for the seventh grader. They're seeking $20 million. Every day he was at school, he was harassed. He went, ended up putting a hood over his head and, tie, uh, and tying it so he'd be invisible so he could just get from one class to the other. As the school year comes to a close at Evergreen Middle, students celebrate, but the Stanfords have no such luxury. I live in a constant state of fear that my son's going to take his life. Constant. We reached out to the Everett School District for comment today. They refused except to say they will investigate the allegations. They have 60 days to do so. We'll keep you posted. In Everett, Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.